What is needed more and more in the business world is actionable intelligence. Reports, dashboards, visuals of enterprise data and trends that help enable decision-making. Being able to show product demand across entire markets, monthly forecasts and growth trends for specific products is extremely useful. Unfortunately, the data needed to create such a report is spread throughout multiple data warehouses and planning systems. For example, the data needed to support this report resides in nearly a dozen different systems. Historical orders and product master data are located in the corporate SAP systems. Customer data is in the Teradata warehouse. Sales forecasts reside in the Salesforce.com system. And yes, some departments still keep their forecast in a local offline Excel spreadsheet. What's more, to make this report more visually appealing, additional demographic and geographic information are needed from a source like Bing or Google Maps. So how do you bring all this data together in a single unified environment? The answer is Data Guru. Data Guru is the tool that enables users to deliver actionable business intelligence from big, messy, and disparate data sources. The following demonstration will give you a first hand look at how Data Guru can enable you to connect to data from any source, view and analyze data from any source regardless of size, then transform the data into a desired and unifying format and publish to your desired application, database, or file format. Plus, automate this process, giving users effortless repeatability in the future. To get started, we'll review the data connections we have established to create our BI dashboard. We have data connections out to Microsoft Access, Excel, SQL Server, ODBC, Oracle, SAP, SAP HANA, and Teradata. Adding a new database connection is easy. First, we select the database provider we want to connect to. We can use stored user preference credentials or enter in the information in the box here. We're able to test our connection to see if the connection is successful. We can then review and select the database we'd like to connect to. Giving our connection a name will allow us to uniquely identify each data source in our project. Once we've established connections, they're all viewed and stored within the connections pane here. We can expand any one of our connections to expose the tables that are available for viewing. With any of our established connections, we're able to open that connection and start to view the data regardless of data source. Data Guru enables you to view data from any connection as if it were a local Excel file. Opening a connection will reveal the data tables the user has permission to access. To open a file, double click on the table name. The data is then loaded into the data grid. The data grid allows users to create filters on one or more columns by selecting the values they want to see or creating expressions. Any column can be dragged to the title bar to create slicers based on distinct values found within a column. An extremely helpful feature is that multiple datasets can be opened and arranged side by side in a tiled view from multiple connections to allow users to understand the relationships presented within their data. By tiling the data tables, you are able to draw visual relationships between the data. The period table holds the actual demand dates by period. Once the forecast table has been transformed using the unpivot action, the tables can be joined. Data Guru gives business analysts the tools they need to transform any data defined using defined data actions. Each section of the action toolbox supports a different stage of the data transformation process. Data import adapters enable you to reach out to your connections to transfer data from any source to any source. Examples of import adapters include database import, delimited file import, and SQL import. The data transforms give you a drag and drop interface enabling any user to manipulate, merge, and sculpt the data once you've transformed it in the correct location. Examples of transforms include unpivot, substitution, data fork, and geocoding. 
Logic controls enable you to create binary logic within your workflow to help your data process respond to changes within the information structure. An example of logic controls include file compare logic. Export adapters enable you to take data from any database and export it into any file format. Examples of export adapters include Excel, text, and CSV files. The real power of Data Guru comes from the macro design process, which enables you to simultaneously configure the data actions and sequence their execution. Data Guru supports both parallel and sequential execution, giving you visual cues to the dependencies and order of operations in a transformation process. The self documenting macros record each step as each new action is created allowing you to focus on transforming your data, not remembering the steps. The Design Surface Radio menu gives you the tools you need to edit, execute, and view action, output, and error messaging. Radio menu includes display and output, view macro actions and summary, copy, rename or delete actions, edit actions, execute actions, and linking. Acquiring and transforming data within Data Guru is very simple. As an example, to work with a local Excel connection, we're going to browse out to that file, select the file, and then drag and drop it into the connections pane, automatically creating the connection. Now that we have our connection, we're going to go within a new macro, go down to the Import Action pane, and grab the Excel Multisheet Import. If both Excel tabs contain structurally similar data, the Excel tabs can be imported into a single tab. Dropping it into the Start icon enables us to sequence this action at the same time that we are configuring the details of the execution. We then select our new connection for the input, and for the output, we can define which database we want to write the data to, and define whether we want to create a single table or separate tables. There's inline support for adding both prefix and suffix naming conventions to Excel import. To help document the process, a name can be given to each action as well as notes to describe the details of the action. At this point, it is important to note the concept of workspace. Remember, all these connections reside in different systems and in different locations. To best transform and sculpt this data, Data Guru enables you to import each of the disparate data sets and structures into a common workspace. This workspace does not need to be located on your local PC. It can be hosted in any one of our supported DBMS, on your laptop, enterprise server, or in the cloud. Now that we've configured our import adapter, we can hover over the action and see the information about what we just did. In this example, the input for the process is coming from a demand forecast. The output is going to be two tables within our workspace called Demand Forecast Raw and Demand Raw. The Unpivot action allows us to take multiple columns and convert them into two unique output columns, the column headers in one and the consolidated row values in another. Every data transformation action allows you to preview the action before you execute it to make sure that the transformation process is correct at each step. The preview data is loaded into the same grid, allowing users to start evaluating the results before the action is executed. If you've forgotten to define a name for the action, you can come back in and use the radio menu options to rename an action. Here we see the unique and extremely valuable relationship between macros and workflows. In the right-hand pane, you can see a macro with a multi-step parallel process combining multiple data sources, doing some weighted averaging and merging these files into a single unified BI output table. This entire process is represented to the right as a single file icon to a higher level workflow. Previous similarly detailed macros are shown in this workflow on the left, and each can be drilled down to reveal the process embedded within. This relationship between macros and workflows helps analysts keep clean, understandable visual maps of the data transformation being performed. 
Now that the data has been blended together, we visualize the disparate data we have collected from around our network. Thanks to the latitude-longitude information we have used to enrich our data, we can now map historical and forecasted customer demand, easily identifying regional shifts in demand and market impact. The Pareto charts allow us to quickly analyze the total demand at the state level, and we can gain further insight into our forecast by visualizing period-by-period -period demand shifts, product segment growth trends, and effects of reporting data aggregation on our customer base. This has been a brief demonstration of how the powerful yet easy-to-use tools in Data Guru can help you connect to any data source, view your data, transform as you wish, publish, and then automate for future use. For additional information, contact Llamasoft at dataguru.com or call 1-866-598-9831. Data Guru from Llamasoft, the data design people.